But listen, I'll never pay for that that way. But um, this guy made this video. <laughs> yeah. And you'll watch it later. And I was watching it, and I was like, and he put bagpipe. We gotta play it now. No, no, we're not gonna play. No, it. please, redeem I yourself. No, no because watch no, it. No, because no, it's, we know we everyone hates you right now. This is gonna be so much better. <laughs> you, uh, uh, I did this for, for a, a retired. Uh, the shortest man in the military, the shortest man to ever serve in the military. Don't laugh. I I'm not him. laughing. And he was a Green Beret in Vietnam. He's four Badass, foot nine. He's dude. four foot nine. He's four nine Green yes. Beret. And he died. Jesus this is the story. Christ. He died. Uh, he became homeless. He served and won like all these medals. And he you say Vietnam in Vietnam. And mm -hmm. he and he and he passed away five years ago. But he died homeless. He was homeless. And so this That's cop, this awesome police officer, who I think was also a Green Beret, said. Uh, I want you to do this. I want you to do a, 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 tri a cameo for this guy. Kind of say some words for him. Here's and I, re I researched him. I looked him up, and I went and he wanted me to kind of do a eulogy for him. I guess did they play I, it at his funeral? I don't. I think they did. I oh, think wow. they played. And I didn't realize. I, I I didn't realize this dude put it to music, and to a collage. And you know, you forget I was doing it. I, I did, did feel you something. Film it a while ago. Uh, about about a week ago. Yeah, so a little bit. Ago. But I felt. When I read about this guy, I was really inspired, and I just kind of spoke from my heart and off the cuff. And this dude made this video, and I found it so moving, even though it was my own words. Mm -hmm. It's not why I was doing it. But when you put bagpipes, you have <laughs> bagpipes. pictures of this you guy. You put bagpipes on anything, right? It's good. So, so watch this. Play it, it, was, Jen. it was cool. I read a whole thing on uh, the Green Beret, Richard J. Flaherty. Who was the smallest Hold on. man? Stop it. Mm -mm. Stop. No, Hold on. Mm -mm. You can't. <laughs> you see what happens? I knew. Jim, why are you laughing? I, it doesn't look real. That's why. I, it, it doesn't. I saw Brennan do this, and we had to wait. This is the Bobby Lee situation. We got to wait. No, I'm good. I swear to God, I'm good. Rest in peace. Go back. You know what's weird is the other soldiers, well, the tallest. I know. The why they do that? So why? No, no, he they, was he was the shortest guy's, man guy's to ever serve in the military. Ten, it's. Actually, an astonishing it's insane. story. No, what's insane is not that he was four seven in the military. It's yeah. insane he was a green beret. Oh, it's nuts! And they, they got to swim. So he, he, he would crawl through the tunnels. Yeah, and all that stuff. <laughs> the tunnels, <laughs> Brian. The, 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 the tunnels. The Viet Cong. God, that's fucked no, up. No, the Viet Cong. Why? Because he's smaller. No, the Viet Cong had a system of tunnels. Yeah, I know. Under, so they would send him in. Because of, <laughs> well, of course you would. Why wouldn't You're you? You're not going in. I can't get in the tunnels. <laughs> he's going in. He's and he's fucking the best, dude. He's the best at it. I know, the best. Yes, but it is. Now play it, Chin. It is pretty awesome and pretty moving. And a bunch right. of uh, green brace chipped in. It'll be a brave dude money to go in those. They, they bought him a headstone. They bought him a headstone. Oh wow! And they gave him a proper burial. Where was his a military burial? They don't know. It's a very sad story. That is so sad. sad. Do you want to go, rewind go, it back? Go, yeah, okay. rewind it so you can see it. Oops. All right, the whole thing here. I uh, I just read a whole thing on uh, the green beret. Richard J. Flaherty, who was the smallest man to ever serve in the United States military. The fact that he was a Green Beret in Vietnam. What a brave dude. You know, um, I guess he was 4'9", 97 pounds. Smallest 97 man ever pounds. Served. Got a silver star, two bronze stars, two purple hearts. Well, May 9th, fifth year, he's been gone. He was homeless. Oh. I think about these things. We're all lucky that we don't fall through the cracks. All of us can. I don't give a shit who you are. I don't care how good you are. I don't care how hard you worked. I don't, I don't care about any of that stuff. There go us by the grace of God. That's what I say. And the minute you start taking credit for your success, for your health, for anything, you better be careful. Because it can be taken away from you look at this, in look a this. heartbeat. In a heartbeat, you know. So I, I I read stories like this, and it fills me with compassion, and it reminds me never to judge, and it reminds me to stay humble, and it reminds me not to think of myself in any way as better than anybody else. And that's the You're one not thing better than right? my children. No, no, no. Uh -uh. Someone like uh, Richard Flair. Look at him. Reminds me of that. I just just the little stuff that I read, pictures I saw. Look how small he is. <laughs> Look at how small he is. Dude, I can't believe it. I mean, this is better than the Rudy story. Make a movie about this guy. I know. Rudy was offside. Make a movie about this guy. Barely played. This yeah. guy fought for our and, freedom. Uh, caught up in that crazy war. And but to the to the bagpipes. It sounds like I've written this. Like I'm you know, doing. It sounds like it's a movie. Like I'm narrating a movie. It or it sounds like you're just talking off the top of your dome. Well, I am. You know, I am. I'm, I was just doing a, a cameo. I think 
all of us can be broken very easily. And I'm glad and I'm thankful and I feel blessed that I've never been put in that situation. I never, I never where were you in the Vietnam War? war. I said, I'm glad I, I was. No, where I were you loved. during the draft? Or watched people die I was in general. I never had to do Not born yet. <laughs> you were born in the 70s? Do you mind? I was born in 1967. I was a little baby. Okay. Like, you know? I'm sorry. Anyway, you thank you for I stopping. You, I thought you were a draft dodger. Uh, I've never seen Chin laugh so hard you know, in my life. I'm so sorry. When I get the giggles, I can't stop I can't it either. That's a, the problem is we're not supposed to laugh yeah. at it. <laughs> yeah, because that's, it's so You sacred. tell me not to, and then you don't. <laughs> then you're like, yeah, he was small, and then they show the video, and he's four seven. Well, it's, it's I wasn't ready for that. because it's astonishing. It's amazing what he was able but, to but, but, And he was he was. How little, does Rudy get a movie? I know, and this guy doesn't. I know, and then just died homeless. You know. Anyway, I'm I'm watching this as this guy's putting bagpipes to it, <laughs> no. and it sounds like I wrote this I'm sure one. When you're by yourself, like, is like super. I got hard. emotional. Yeah, in here, not in so my much. own words. In here, not so much with the three of us, but <laughs> in here, not so much because we're you're all dead behind the eyes and you're not American. <laughs> there's a there's a you can look find at, humor look at, in look anything. At these, look at these though. I, I was so no, blown away. It looks like a child. Yeah, that's with all these soldiers and was a green. Beret. How about the one picture they have him at the deli at the counter with that with that cop? It's so nuts. And then and then he what a stud yeah look and at then that he, look at that and then he just became they're carrying uh, them they're hoisting look, them up look, look, oh, wow look, 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 look at this that's not come incredible on, come on nuts. come on is that crazy or well, what? think how much harder it is for him when they're running and, stuff. and let me through tell you the jungle of vietnam <laughs> and the green berets went through some shit in vietnam oh dude i mean <laughs> and the Viet Congies? yeah i mean it wasn't they were our special forces they were you know um and, i mean I, it's just it's uh, uh richard j flatter Flattery? Flaherty, 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 an Irishman. Flaherty. Yeah, it's captain, super. captain, and then just became God, that, the, the, the 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 homeless thing's a bummer. Yeah, That's and forgotten, and forgotten until this one. I wish I could know. I, I wish I could give a shout out to the police officer because I think he was a Green Beret or something like that. And uh, Eddie sent that to me. Eddie sent it to me. Yeah, I know. Right in on Dude, our fight companion. How about uh, just so we can switch subject? How about uh, there it is? Yeah, yeah. That was crazy. Him at the deli there. But uh, how about uh, Eddie made Barstool Sports? He did? Yeah, it said uh, Eddie gives one of the most, uh, you know, great performances on uh, Fight Companion. Okay. Hey, by the way, the cop's name is David Yuzik, and he took his time out of, he paid for it and everything, took his yeah, time no, to, to give this guy a send-off. So shout out to yeah. Miami cop David Yuzik. Thanks, man. You're a good man. Um. Anyway, yeah, I think you're right. I never thought of that. There should be a movie about that. The smallest guy in the military? I'd watch it. Steven Spielberg would make that movie. A four foot who would play the character? Who Steven would, Private Flaherty? Yeah. Who would play the who would play that? Find an actor who's that small. You'd have to find a legit Oh the uh, the, the that's Dinklage. A dwarf. Oh yeah, okay. Peter Dinklage. No, Peter Dinklage, Dinklage is a dwarf. Dinklage yeah. is spray paint him. A different kind spray of <laughs> D Dinklage isn't athletic enough to be a Green Beret. You need a small man. You you basically need somebody who's totally proportioned. Okay, mm. you do. You need to. Yeah, you can't have a small person because they're not. They don't have the. Well, yeah, that's the legs. That, that's a dwarf. There's a dwarf. There's, and what's the other one? Because uh, your your boy didn't have dwarfism. He's just a small person. Right. He's a small person. Mm -hmm. So dwarfism is different. That that comes with dwarf with uh, dwarfs can't be or small people can't be in the uh, special. It's forces. very no, not, I don't think they can run their no, joints. They have you, issues, too many right, things. Too many hips. issues. Yeah. yeah. But uh, and also their ass is fit in the pants. All that stuff, dude. Yeah. But that guy, you, you've got to be. Is that? Is that? Uh, it's an article on oh, military.com. Four foot nine Four foot inches, nine. dude. Do they have a picture of Call him the walking? giant killer? They're just that's him right there, and then. Uh, Damn, that's nuts. We can dude. play this Think if you guys this. want. Play that for a second. I want to see it. Okay. Play the whole thing, too. Yeah, it's, I don't know. <laughs> you wouldn't do. I'm telling you, they're gonna make a movie about this. I don't know if that was Richard. Why don't doing you make it, not, it? But he certainly didn't show any. Wow. Emotion he shot all those people down. What had happened? Uh, I don't think so. Went to the river. Fuck. And I think it was in what we called the Eight Bill at that time. It was this uh, long, eight thousand meter village that ran with a river running through it, and it was a known area where you're going to get contact. You never went in the Eight Click Bill without running into the enemy. For some reason, they just kept coming back there, and so we're doing a sweep. And uh, my unit had jumped some uh, North Vietnamese in Viet Cong on one side of the river. And uh, we shot several of them, uh, but they did not, they weren't dead. And I 
it's going to call for a medevac helicopter, uh, you know, a dust off to get them out of there. So because I had the medics work on them and, you know, look like, oh. OK, well, they're about as stable as they're going to get. And so I'm radioing over to Richard and I said, uh, I've got uh, two uh, Victor Charlie WIA. And he said, Roger, two Victor Charlie KIA. And I said, no, no, WIA. I said, so when do, you know, Whiskey India Alpha. And he says, no, he kept coming back with the KIA. And I knew what he was saying, because he was saying basically, what, let's just move on, kill them, let's just go. Wow. And I had guys in my platoon that were looking at me going, no, we don't want to do this. I'll tell you, that's it. So Miami police officer hmm. David Yusick befriended a homeless man, and after 15 years of friendship, Richard J. Flaherty finally revealed oh, who wow. he was. Yusick learns that this unassuming 69-year-old man was a decorated military veteran. So that that's shout out to Miami police officer David Yusick. Soon that's so cool. Flaherty is killed by a hit and run driver. Oh, God. And he was hit by a hit yeah, killed by a hit and run driver. Um He did time in prison for drugs. Yeah, I'm sure, you know. Um, yeah. Uh, Giant Killer is uh, one of those strange, sec- stranger uh, than fiction tales that would never make it as a movie peach movie pitch because it's so unbelievable. So well, they, there's kind of a movie here, it's called The Giant Killer. I'm sorry? They, they kind of did like a documentary movie called The Giant Killer. It huh. looks like it's on iTunes and okay. Amazon. Huh. Um, well, there you go. Okay, The Giant Killer. Then also him I'll doing time it. in prison for drugs. They don't know if it was just a cover because he did some undercover work or if it was a real conviction. Oh, wow. A lot to unfold there. <sighs> a lot to unfold. Really, really interesting. Man. That's crazy. Four foot nine. Crazy. Yeah. Oh, um, check out the giant killer. Yeah, man. Damn, he was hit by a car. That sucks. His story is crazy. It's definitely a movie worthy story. I think it is a movie worthy story. Yeah. I hope they optioned it. Maybe it's a really good idea. I'm going to send that to uh, Joe Carnahan and Frank Grillo. That, that's the kind of movie that Carnahan sure. would write. Hell yeah. Who's that. the actor? Who's the shortest actor in Hollywood? There's this, there's some small ones now, right? Like, who's the the guy that played John Lent? No, John. You know who could play it? Brecken Meyer. <laughs> Brecken Meyer is uh, my my buddy. And I remember him actor. too. Yeah. And Brecken's you. five four. Still too tall. It's a little too tall. But you could get tall actors around. Tall him soldiers and, around. And with him? with CGI now, you can do all kinds of weird shit. I, I guarantee there's a guy who's four 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 seven or four nine. Where the fuck he was? Who would yeah. do it? They're out there. This guy, Taron Edgerton, that played Elton John. I was thinking of Elton John. How is he super is he? short? I think he's pretty short. I don't think he's that short, though. Let's see. 5'9". Five Five nine. Nine. Oh, Never mind. Yeah. Never mind. The shortest actor I can think of is that guy from Hannah Montana, Moises Aris. He's like 5'1". Moises Oh, well, you know who's short is that guy, <clears throat> Jon Snow. Oh, short. yeah, Jon Snow. Well, he's 5'3". He's fucking 5'3"? Five five three? Three? Or is he 5'5"? Five five? <laughs> That's him next like to him, five, though. Six, he's not. That's maybe? him next to who? Edgerton. And he was five six. Yeah, it looks like he's probably around five six. Oh, wow, and your boy has heels on there too. So yeah, let me see. Probably five five. Boy, he's a tiny fella. John Snow's probably five five. Damn, that's still that's too big. Dikembe Mutombo compared to four seven. Yeah, that's a short guy, John Snow. That's he's not five eight. Shit. No, he's shorter than five eight. <clears throat> we'll find someone there out there. Yeah. Yeah. Brendan Schaub <laughs> <laughs> plays the giant. Danny DeVito, 410. Oh, yeah. Danny DeVito would be. <laughs> yeah. He's a little too old. Joe Pesci, 5'4. Hold on. Let me see. Go back. Uh, Frankie Muniz would be great. Oh, yeah. Five. Frankie Muniz. He'd be great at it. Uh, Bruno Mars. Uh, Simon Heller. These aren't that Muniz. short, though. That's really right. short. Um, Kevin Hart. <clears throat> Um, Scorsese's 5'4". Scott Kahn's only 5'5"? Five, five. Yeah, he's tiny. Scott Kahn's so short. Scorsese's short. Jason Alexander, Bruno Mars. Daniel Radcliffe would be great. Um, hold on. So, uh, go back for a second. Damn, Dreyfus is only 5'5"? Five, five? Ooh, see if Woody Allen would do it. <laughs> yeah, Scott's Four, seven, Scott's a super five. macho guy. Like he's, a, you, know. He, you know he's a white rapper. Scott Kahn. Before he got it. Yeah, he was, he was in a straight, legit rap group. Well, Crazy, huh? I mean, sure. James Caan. Again, white rapper. Famous James Caan is about 5'9". I've worked with him. Elijah Wood. Elijah Wood is tiny. Yeah. 
All the hobbits are well, they're small in general. Ooh, James uh, McAvoy. Yeah, yeah. McAvoy. Who? John Stewart. So awesome. Macaulay Culkin. No, I didn't know Macaulay great. Culkin was so small. <clears throat> Sheen, five seven. Ben Stiller, five seven. Tom Cruise, five God, seven. Some great <sighs> actors. Got the smaller actors are ridiculous. Al Pacino is even smaller than that. Jonah Hill, five seven. David Spade. Zac Efron is only five eight. Yeah, I thought he was actually smaller for some reason. Jeffrey yeah, these are Hollywood, so you got to take Wahlberg. off about two inches. <laughs> Mark Wahlberg is go back. Yeah, he's short. Five yeah. eight. I don't even know if Mark Wahlberg's 5'8". I don't, yeah, he might. Well, yeah, you got to remember, these guys have inches. shoes on. They're adding some inches here. Yeah. <clears throat> wow. Well, we should keep looking. Robert Downey Jr., <laughs> only 5'9". What? Yeah. Yeah, I remember. I thought Brad Pitt was a little taller than 5'11", but he's my height. I've never seen him in person. Hmm. All righty. Yeah. Hmm. Well. Good luck with your movie, dude. Uh, the, my, 